question. <laughs> Today, we will be making another reindeer themed food. Can you guess what it is? No, no, no. We will be making rainbow spaghetti. Rainbow spaghetti? Wow! Yummy! <laughs> so, are you ready to get started? Yes! Let's go! But first, let's have a look at the ingredients. You will need dry spaghetti, some food coloring. We will be using red, purple, blue, yellow, and green. One cup of grated parmesan cheese, some zip seal bags, some water, a pinch of salt, and some oil. Let's get started. Step one, cook the pasta according to package instructions. For us, we will be boiling some water with a little oil and salt. Then, add in the dry pasta and let it cook for about 15 minutes. Step 2. While the pasta is cooking, combine about 2 tablespoons of water and 20 drops of food coloring in a large zip seal bag. Repeat with however many additional colors you would like. We use the five colors, red, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Step three. When the pasta is finished cooking, transfer it to a large strainer to drain. Then immediately rinse it in cold water to stop the cooking. Now transfer the pasta in even portions to the prepared zip seal bags and seal. Use your hands to carefully combine the pasta and food coloring and then let each bag sit for at least one minute to soak up the color. Did you know rainbow pasta has become very popular for kids around the world? Step 4. Now, one color at a time, transfer a bag of pasta back to the strainer and rinse with cold water to remove any extra food coloring. Repeat with the remaining colors of pasta. Now, transfer the pasta back to your pot. Toss all of the colors of pasta together to combine the colors. Step 5. Finally, let's make some parmesan clouds. First, preheat your oven to 180 degrees Celsius. Now, on a flat baking tray lined with some parchment paper, place about 2 tablespoons of grated parmesan cheese in a flat circle. You can use a cookie cutter to help shape your circles if desired. Now bake for about 4 to 5 minutes until the cheese is melted and the edges begin to brown. Then remove and let it sit for at least 2 minutes. All done! Wow! This rainbow spaghetti is so colourful and it looks super yummy! Thank you for watching. See you all next time.